Okay, welcome back to another video. In one of my latest videos, I said, I've always wanted to be a content creator since I was a child. So today, I'm going to be looking at my old videos from when I was an aspiring content creator at the ripe age of 12. These are privated. <laughs> These are unlisted for a reason. I'm just going to be reacting to them and I'm going to bring you guys with me. So let's get started. Okay, here we are. So this is my YouTube studio. And, uh, these are kind of my oldest videos. Uh, oh God, these are just the memories are flooding in. Anyway, I'm, I don't know how I'm going to go about this because there's so many. I think I'm just going to watch the ones that are like captivating, I guess, if any of these are captivating. But I think I'm going to start with this one, which is called Don't Steal My Cheerios. I don't know what this is. This was a joke story, but hope you guys enjoyed. I'm nervous, but let's watch it. Welcome back to another video. And, uh, <laughs> so, um, so Oof. I'm just going to be, uh, Oh my God, bro. I sound like a woman, bro. I sound like a nine year old girl. It's a little story, but before I do, um, oh my God. I woke up this morning and I was scrolling through my YouTube channel, right? I looked at my latest uploads. Uh-huh. Yeah. And, um, I, I saw that, that dislike, that like to dislike ratio. Oh my and God. honestly, it made me want to cry. Yeah, so, I wonder why. Yeah. I wonder why most of, most of the, uh, feedback on that video was, uh, dislikes. I don't even know which video it was, but whatever. I'm, I'm a sad boy now. No, but- Oh my God, just- for real, like, <laughs> I really don't care. Um, yes, you do. No, I wasn't sad. Yes, I, you do. Yes, you did. I, yes, you I were. I really didn't care too much. But yes, uh, yes, you did. That's a lie. I cared deeply. I cared so deeply about the feedback that I got on my videos at the time. Especially because I was so, like, self-conscious about the content I uploaded. But now it's, like, I'm actually confident in my uh, videos. So After that, I decided to go outside. and uh No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I never went outside. I never went outside. <laughs> um, I found that this was. Oh God! What is this? A camel spider? Living in my lawn. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah. Dude, I sound like yeah, a girl. That, <laughs> that's that's the thing now. Um, yeah, I'm scared. Okay, I'm scared. Oh my God! But, um, this is a tough watch. Anyway. This story takes place not too long ago, about, uh -huh. let's say, a couple days ago. Oh, a couple days ago, and, yeah. And, um, it, uh, <laughs> it was pretty sad. Anyway, let's just get I right into the story. I like how you can tell I don't have a script, because I keep taking, like, 10 second pauses, thinking about what to say. Alright, so... It was a nice sunny day. Woke up. Okay, nice sunny day. Woke up. All right. Put some clothes on. Some clothes on. Went downstairs to go make uh -huh. some breakfast. Uh huh. I decided to make Cheerios. Oh, yummy Cheerios. So I got my Cheerio box down. Mhm. Mm put it in the. There is literally like seven minutes left of this video. I have no clue where this is going. Oh. I don't. Open the door, go get some milk. Uh huh. And there was none. Well, there's no milk. How, how there's sad. no milk, guys. I was sad, devastated. I mean, there's no way I was gonna eat dry Cheerios. <laughs> so there's, there's no way. I figured, all right, I'll just go to the store and go buy me some milk so that I can uh, eat yeah, my buddy, Cheerios. In yeah, just making it clear, I would never go to the store to buy anything when I was 12 years old. I was way too socially awkward. Peace. So that's what I did. I opened the door and I hopped in my imaginary red convertible and I What? I'm so confused. Headed okay. up to the store. So I got to the store and when I was there I, uh, I went into- I went in the store and you, you already know, like, when you go into a store, this basically goes for anything, like, a restaurant, or just, like, any store. If there's that Christian white boy 
that is just right next like you walk into the store and he's just right there and he tells you to make sure make sure to wipe the handles on of your shopping cart with disinfecting wipes that you know that this shop ride is gonna be good right what <laughs> what no one says that bro what i'm so confused i'm so confused he told me and i thought okay i thought that this was going to be a perfect shopping ride because because that one guy was there so I, I went in the store went to the milk section and what do you know there was no milk well there was milk but there wasn't any skim milk This is so stupid. This is the dumbest story ever. There's 2% milk. 1%. I can't sit through the rest of this. I'm just gonna skip skip through it like five minute mark. And I stopped her right as she was about to to take that that bite of Cheerios. I stopped her. She put the spoon down, put it in her bowl, and I told her, what are you doing? She told me, I'm eating Cheerios. I said, where'd you get the milk? She told me, it was in the refrigerator. I knew she was lying. So I told her, you're lying, aren't you? She said, no. What? I told her, yes, you are. What? So I went. The, I opened the refrigerator, and what do you know? There was no milk. So I told her, why is there no milk in this refrigerator? And she told me, okay, it wasn't in the refrigerator. I said, I knew it. And you were lying, where did you get the skim milk? She told me she got it from a friend. I was what? furious. Why did she get the skim milk? But I didn't. This is so stupid. It didn't make sense. I wanted to do some investigating, but I knew there was no time for that. So I said, give me the milk now. Oh God. Wait, what? Wait, no. Give me the cereal now. What? She said no. So this is this is too stupid. I can't sit through the rest of this. I'm not. I like how the thumbnail is just a, a JPEG of Cheerios. Oh god, what is this? <laughs> Break up story time. Dude, this is a right after I broke up with like my girlfriend. Dude, I was literally 12. I was literally 12 and we were dating for like a month. Oh god, that's loud. Oh god, that's loud. Hey guys, Lynn here. Welcome back to another video. Uh, hey guys, Lunar here. Welcome back to another video. Oh my god, bro, what are you talking about? Well, this is actually abysmal. Video. And today, uh, we have a story time video. Now, I know you guys don't like these videos. <laughs> Um, because no one was giving feedback on these videos. No one was even sitting through all of these. Because they're kind of stupid. Um, yeah, but, they are. <laughs> um, I don't care. So I do apologize for any background noise you may hear during this video. I really do apologize. I okay, not... quit yapping. Just get to the story. No. Um, so, <laughs> basically, um, uh... This is going to be a story time video. This is going to be a breakup story time video. No, oh I know God. I'm a little kid and I don't know anything about love. Uh, this is a tough watch. This is a tough watch. This is a tough watch. This is painful. <laughs> this is painful. So a kid, basically, you get with somebody. You get kissed on the cheek. She breaks up with you. Or you break up with her. Mm -hmm. Or whatever sexuality you are i don't care um so that's so stupid yeah, that's pretty much how relationships work oh Basically. my god what am i yapping so, like right I said, now i don't know anything about love but when someone breaks up with me i really don't care all right if someone breaks up this is so not true this is so not true <laughs> Oh my god, this is so not true. I just said I don't care when someone breaks up with me. This is so not true. I literally made this entire video because my girlfriend at the time broke up with me. She broke up with me. I got pissed and I started like roasting her. 
for no dude i was like 12 okay i don't know why i did that and i was like roasting her and stuff because she was low-key a hoe because like she left me for another dude bro it's so stupid i was we were literally 12 bro oh my god anyway i started roasting her like obviously like i was super insecure because i was like really insecure about myself anyway like i didn't like the way i looked and shit and bro, i can't blame her for leaving me bro i was like it's fine but um I literally cared so much when she broke up with me, and then I made this entire video, and she saw this video, by the way, I wanted her to see it, so I posted it on my Snapchat story, because we still had each other added, and she saw it, and like, she went off on me, <laughs> yeah, bro, it's so stupid. Up with me. So what? So be it. Unless it's like, a dumb reason, but uh, still, I won't really get that bad, but... Yeah, so uh, that's just me. So no, that's not just you. <laughs> All right, let's actually get to the start of the story. I'm not the type of person to get mad from a breakup. Now, yes, I, I am. Dating this girl, um, Emma. I'm just gonna call her Emma for. Her name was Emily. Her name was Emily. I privacy reasons. So Emma and I were dating in October, and I believe she broke up with me in November, so. Bro, we were literally dating for a month. Holy shit. You know, that really was not a long relationship, but we were still dating. And it was kind uh, of a strong relationship, but we were dating. Nah, no, it wasn't. Uh, one month. And, um, you know, was, uh, <sighs> this is so painful. It didn't go, you know, the way I expected it. So we were dating very strong relationship. Uh, she was being very loyal. Um, oh my God. Okay. Oh, I muted it. Hold up. <laughs> I muted it. There we go. Sunny day. I was chilling, playing Call of Duty Zombies, trying to get to high rounds. And I get a notification. Staying focused, getting those high rounds on zombies. Can't lie, that was a W move by me. Phone. It's from Snapchat, so I open it, and it's Emma, and I'm like, okay, finally, I'm not bored, cause now. Oh my I'm god. Not actually, talk to someone. So, oh my god. um, yeah. So, <laughs> I get the text, and it says, "Are we dating?" And it was really confusing when I first saw that, and I was like, "What?" So it said, "Are we dating?" Obviously, we are like, so we talked about this. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Bro. So it said, are we dating? Obviously, we are like, so we talked about this. <laughs> yeah, well, well, obviously, we're dating. Uh, I thought we talked about this. Um, what do you mean? <laughs> oh my what god. Prior. So. Um, yeah, so she's like, are we dating? Because if we are, I think we should just be friends. And I'm like, okay, so I just got friend zoned. <laughs> so oh. <laughs> this is physically painful. This is physically pain. This is genuinely painful. So, you know, that was, you know, it's just a face slap, you know? Like I said, I don't get mad. It's just like, okay, that just happened. So... No, I was immensely mad. I was immensely upset. Notice how I used the word mad and not sad because I was mad. Major face slap and um Why is that a face slap, bro? It wasn't a face slap, bro. She had every right to leave me, bro. I was ugly as hell. I barely FaceTimed her because I was so ugly I didn't want to show my face. I sounded like this, bro. I sounded like a child. Oh my god. I sounded like a little girl. I mean I was twelve, but like jeez. I was also really fat, so, uh, like, I was really fat when I was 12, bro. I was like, eat a whole jar of peanut butter at 12 in the morning fat, bro, like, this is crazy. So, I was like, okay, and she's like, we just, we don't talk as much as I want us to, I was like, we talk every day, and then I can tell her. <laughs> we talk every day, what are you talking about? Because you know how girls are. <laughs> Or at least some girls. I'm not being sexist. Oh you know, my god. Some girls, uh. they, like, they like to tell lies. 
Some girls like to tell lies. Not sexist, though. <laughs> Proceeds to generalize a whole gender. Like, they they know they're telling a lie. Like, a really dumb lie. <laughs> and they know they can get away with it. Because, for some reason, they do. So, yeah, so she... This is so stupid. That's a lie right there. We literally talked every day. Um... And we've only been dating for one month. So, um, she, so yeah, she. Oh, so I might cut this because this is 11 minutes. This is a whole, this is, this is so long. So I might like cut this. So yeah, if there's like a jump cut, just like, that's why. Break up and like 10, well, I just bit my tongue. I'm sorry. So 10 seconds later. Um, 10 seconds later. Um, I'm scrolling through Snapchat literally 10 or 15 seconds later, and I see that she uploaded on his story. And you know, you know, those girls on Snapchat who are always like, Oh my god, I'm so lucky to be with him. I, I love him so much. What? <laughs> what? What is this? You know, you know, bro, what in the world? Why was that such a good impression, though? I'm so lucky to be with him. I, I love him so much. Bro, you know what's crazy though? I used to actually voice troll like get, like people on Xbox and I would like pretend to be a girl and I'd like voice troll voice troll them and I'd like do my best girl impression and like basically break their heart. Dude, I was fucked up. I don't know why I did that. I just it was so funny to me. <laughs> now, now I can't do that because I can't even do a girl voice impression. Nor would I even do it, but anyway. You know, you know, like those girls, um, on Snapchat. Yeah. So that's pretty much what she uploaded on her story. She's like, oh my God, I love him so much. Oh my God. That was not 10 seconds later. This was like three days later. I know where I'm going with this. I'm going to say like she left me for another person, which I'm pretty sure she did. But even still, like she had every right to. So. And uh, I was confused. Cause I was but this is a complete exaggeration, bro. It was like a. It might have been a week after we broke up when she posted that. Like, wait, she just- I like, like, I like how I just got done talking about how she was lying, and then I proceed to spread more misinformation. She just broke up with me, like, 10, 15 seconds ago, and she's already dating someone, so I'm like, huh, <laughs> did she break up with me for someone else? Uh, wow. So, uh, I text her. Um, and I'm like, who's on your story? And she said, oh, that's my boyfriend. And I'm like, you already have a boyfriend, huh? And she's like, yeah. Um, and I was like, okay, how did you get a boyfriend in 10 seconds? So. Oh my God, bro. She's like, well. Uh, yeah, like, this is so painful. So, so she, I think she said, I texted my crush or something. And. He, uh, he, he wanted to be my boyfriend. I was like, oh my god. Because right there, I was like, yeah, okay. So she just broke <laughs> up with me for someone else. So, Bro. yeah. You know, yeah. So, left me for someone else. So, you know, that's uh, pretty sad. Yeah. That's basically the story. Very cool. That's the story? And there is... Bro, that's the story, and it's still 11 minutes long. That's the story, and it's there's still four whole minutes left of me just yapping. About what? About what? What am I yapping about? Cold. She left me for someone else, and uh... That's the story. You want to know the funny... <laughs> That's the story. But let's go for a four minute yap sesh. Well, the funny thing, a couple weeks after she was dating this guy, he broke up with her because... Oh, what? thought that she was cheating on him. Really? Which, makes a lot of sense so <laughs> i don't even know if this is true or not i think it is though i think it is though that's funny Ever? well i know who who is dating her but no i didn't <laughs> no i didn't whoever that was i'm gonna say billy we'll, we'll name him billy billy <laughs> billy i didn't i had no clue what his name was literally Maybe I knew his name, but like I did not know who he was. You made the right decision. 
you're not watching this. I know you're not. But you made the right decision. We were 12. You say thought. T-H-O-T. Oh, my God. Bro, we were literally 12, and I'm calling this little girl a thought, bro. I'm calling this 12-year-old a thought. I can't sit through this video anymore, bro. Okay, I'm going to have to end the video here, because that's that's literally about all I can take. Um, I still have more videos in the vault, so if you guys want me to make another reacting to my privated videos, I'll do another video. But uh, yeah, this was cancerous. Um, anyway... Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Bye.